Greetings to you, each of you, the members of the whole world missionary Baptist Church. I pray that this message finds you in good health and strength and that you are prospering even as your soul does prosper. As we say each week, we're certainly thankful to God for all of his blessings toward us. And as we go forward in the midst of those blessings, we pray that they would only increase and that he would continue to show his favor in our lives. I want to say this is the month of excitement that's upon us, the month of October. We're going to be sharing in our celebration of the uh, 163rd church anniversary on the third Sunday. And also it's going to include a mortgage burning in, as as a part of that service as well. So we want you to invite family and friends to be with us in this momentous occasion. Uh, what a wonderful blessing has taken place in the life of the church. And we look forward to even greater things that God has in store. This Sunday, as a kickoff to the month, I've asked my good friend, Pastor Reginald Johnson, if he would just come by and give us the word so. That'll be a treat for you on Sunday. For those of you who are here, we're sort of looking forward to what God is going to speak through him. Please don't forget on the third Sunday, we welcome Pastor Elliot Ivey from Oakland, California uh, to be with us from the Church of Restoration. Uh, we're certainly looking forward to him and what God will bring and the word through him on that Sunday as well. And then we're so thankful for all of the persons who have joined with our congregation in the last few months. Uh, you have been a blessing to uh, the church and the church family. We certainly praise God for your gifts and the assignments that, on, that are on your life. Now, I also say that because we're going through a series on Wednesday night called the Alive and Active Church. So even tonight, there's going to be a demonstration. Uh, we're not just going to talk about it. We're going to demonstrate it. And so we're definitely looking forward to that. And please, ma'am, please, sir, preferably consider joining with us each week uh, in our midday Bible study each second and fourth Wednesday at 11 a.m. with the lunch and then the study uh uh, convenes at 11.15 to 12.15, and then on each Wednesday night at 6.30 to 7.30 p.m., we are here in the sanctuary, and then our youth are gathered as well for their lesson. So we have a lot of great things that are going on. We praise God for what he's doing in the life of the church, and then we praise God for those who are active in your assignment. And if you're looking for that place uh, to serve, we pray that you would be in prayer, <laughs> and that you would continue to avail yourself to the Word of God and to communicate with him that he might reveal those things to you. There's a whole lot more that I could say to you, but in the in the interest of time, I just want to say, may God bless you. Let's remember those among us who are sick. Several have gone through uh, surgeries and been in the hospital. Uh, we certainly pray your recovery and your healing. We pray for Deacon Glenn Moore on this very day, uh, who was there in the procedure in Birmingham. We ask and pray that God would bless him and bring him through this. And then many others who are going through moments of bereavement and other various trials that we may not even be aware of. But in the midst of all those things, we pray that the Lord be glorified and that you be encouraged in all things. May the Lord Jesus Christ. Christ be your strength and the joy of your salvation guide you through this season that you're in. God bless you, and we'll talk to you soon.